Hello, I am David W. Parker. This is Programming Today I Learned, WebGL series, episode 34. This is Reading Pixels, part 2. Today we're going to be drawing shapes and then simultaneously being able to read the pixels of those shapes with just a small toggle uh, click. So here we go, uh, our, our setup here, the main difference is we have a new global with, for press keys and it's a JSON object, JavaScript object. Uh, we're going to go ahead and a callback, so we're going to have key down and key up uh, added back. Uh, everything here is going to be from previous episodes when we're drawing, so and we're just going to stick with triangles today. And then finally down here, we're going to go ahead on key down, we're going to have the key code equal to true if it's pressed, and key code equal to false if it's up. Uh, finally, we're going to be checking for key code 16, which is shift, the shift key. So if we're holding shift, we're going to do what we did last episode and read the number of pixels. And if we're not holding shift, we're going to be adding to our points and then drawing out. So what this looks like is we have a blank canvas here. And like, as soon as I click, I can be drawing out different triangles all over the screen. And then anytime I want to hold shift, I can be uh, reading the pixel values or the color values of those pixels uh, wherever they may be. So that's kind of it for this episode. It was just kind of be nice and sweet. Um, but that's why you can just kind of start seeing how we could put things together in terms of user interactions and dealing with pushing keyboard things and doing things like that. Um, if you like what you saw today, please subscribe, like the video, share it on social media, check out programmingtil.com, and sign up for my newsletter. Have a great one. Bye.